All right, thank you guys for coming back. This is part two of Let's Play Mass Effect. I am beyond excited to continue this Let's Play. I've been waiting to do this for so long. This is by far my favorite game series of all time. I know I didn't talk much about it last episode, but that's because, you know, I love introducing and conversations and all that. Oh shit. I honestly haven't played this game in a while. I'm gonna have to remember how to play. <laughs> oh well, shouldn't be too bad. This is supposed to be a paradise of a planet, Eden Prime, but looks like crap so far. <laughs> but as I was saying earlier, the whole conversations thing in this game, by far, it just makes makes it so awesome. You can pick what happens in the game, basically. And the decisions you make in this game, if you, if you haven't played the game, these games yet, you'll realize that the decisions you make in 1 affect 2 and 3 like, drastically. It's it's incredible. What's going on here? No! Jenkins! I don't remember how to use my skills. Oh, there we go. Figured it out. <laughs> Throw. Eh. Yeah, no, I'm not going to be that ballsy about the fighting later on. It's, uh, <laughs> that'd be a bad idea. Poor Jenkins. Oh. A chance. We'll see that he receives a proper service once the mission is complete. But I need you to stay focused. Aye, aye, sir. All right. Let's do this shit. You can shoot these things, but it doesn't doesn't do anything pretty pointless. Oh god. How do we get in cover? I forget. Oh, there we go. Have a look. And for now, I will show the level up screens, but you just gotta, I don't know, just comment, let me know if you guys actually care about this, because I mean, if not, then I don't care. <laughs> I'm not going to show it, but if you guys want to see the level up screens, then why not? So for now, I will. Got some burned out buildings here, Shepard. A lot of bodies. I'm going to check it out. I'll try to catch up with you at the dig site. I'm not going to mess with the armor and stuff like that on screen, like the upgrades and stuff. I'm just going to do that. I either I'm going to, you know, do it in, in the video and cut it out, or I'm just going to do it in between. Baby back bitches. Hey. Damn. <laughs> I was wondering if it was gonna do it at all and all of a sudden it just blew up my face. Here is actually one of my favorite one of my I wouldn't say my favorite, but I don't know. I, I like her. She's a really cool character. The hell is going on here? Holy shit. Well, damn. These are the Geth. They're some of my favorite enemies in the game, in the series, honestly. They're they're awesome. They're just so cool. And as the games go on, you find out more and more about them. And they're awesome. They're just so cool. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. You the one in charge here, sir? Are you wounded, Williams? A few scrapes and burns. Nothing serious. The others weren't so lucky. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. 
Where's the rest of your squad? We tried to double back to the beacon, but we walked into an ambush. I don't think any of the others... I think I'm the only one left. This isn't your fault, Williams. You couldn't have done anything to save them. Yes, sir. We held our position as long as we could, until the Geth overwhelmed us. The Geth haven't been seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. Why are they here now? They must have come for the beacon. The dig site is close, just over that rise. It might still be there. We could use your help, Williams. Aye, aye, sir. It's time for payback. Move out. Oh, boy. All right, I'm going to mess with my armor and stuff. I guess I'll show it the first time. So, oh god, didn't mean to do that. Since you guys haven't really seen it before. But other than that, I'm not going to. All right, equipment. Here is the equipment screen where you can show all of your weapons and all that good stuff. And your armor. Now I got the scorpion armor on. Did I get uh, upgrades? Yes. Um, no, I'm not going to do either of those. No, empty. Okay. I'm going to switch to... Assault rifle. Where are we? Okay, going this way. <laughs> it's pretty easy to get turned around in this game. Those... A lot of my friends who played this game, that was one of their biggest complaints with this game was, um, at least with Mass Effect 1, was getting lost. It's really easy to get lost <laughs> in Mass Effect 1. Kinda, uh, yeah, I mean like on on the future planets we're going to go to, like uh, spoil, a little spoiler alert, Pharos and Novaria, those places are just... Uh, uh, they're not fun. I'm not looking forward to going there. I shouldn't say they're not fun. They have some really cool story parts to them, but it's really easy to get lost. Like really, really easy to get lost. <laughs> this is the dig site. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Our side or the Geth? Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. You think anyone got out of here alive? If they were lucky. Maybe hiding up in the camp. It's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. Whoa. Come on now, game. Thank you. Uh, it'll do that a lot, actually. There's a small spaceport up ahead. Oh, that's reduced. That's Omni Gel on accident. Whoopsie. I want to check it out. I'll wait for you there. Nihilus is pretty cool. Pretty big story like with him is about to happen. <laughs> it's a good place for an ambush. Keep your guard up. God, they're still alive. What did the Geth do to them? So I'm pretty curious as to see who has played this game and who hasn't. So, go ahead and leave a comment. I'm, I'm just curious. I think it'd be kind of interesting to see. Because like I said before, this is my favorite game series ever. I think it deserves a little more recognition. Well, damn. That was pretty intense. Alright, let's go over here. Some stuff. Oh, uh, just on the gel. This place is kind of fun. Here's encrypting. It's pretty simple. The buttons pop up, you press the buttons. <laughs> it's pretty self explanatory. Uh, it's not too difficult. Humans, thank the Maker. Hurry, close the door before they come back. Don't worry, we'll protect you. Thank you, I think we'll be okay now. It looks like everyone's gone. You're Dr. Warren, the one in charge of the excavation. Do you know what happened to the beacon? It was moved to the spaceport this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to help pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to save us. No one is saved. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, only ruin and corpses will remain. 
This is right here. This part is hilarious. If you want to be renegade, you know, like the asshole of it, you can straight knock this guy out. It's amazing. It's so funny. It's one of my favorite quotes. To see the future, to see the destruction rushing towards us, to understand there is no escape, no hope. No, I am not mad. I'm the only sane one left. Maybe he's right. I gave him an extra dose of his meds. I, if you press this right here, I can shut him up. You straight knock him out. And it is funny as hell. <laughs> you know what? N now I said I have to do it. Say goodnight, I have brother. to. I, I'm not going to be a renegade character. But this my is... Voice must be heard. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! What that might have been a little extreme. <laughs> you can't just go around whacking people in the head. That's just it was only a matter of time. It's funny as hell. I could not do dangerous. it. I suppose you're right. By the time he wakes up, the meds will have kicked in. So Thanks. funny. Take us to the spaceport. So funny. Good luck, Commander. Nine renegade points. Whoopsies. <laughs> oh well. Yeah, no, I'm. I'm gonna be more of a Paragon character in these in these let's plays, but. Some of the renegade options, especially in Mass Effect 1, are just hilarious. I couldn't tell you how many people you can just walk around and punch in the face. It's amazing. Saren. Nihilus. This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The Council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. Yeah. So that just happened. What is that? Off in the distance. We're gonna need a bigger boat. throw does. Boom! <laughs> Basically force push. <laughs> Omni gel. Everybody stay calm out there. We're coming out. We're not armed. Is it safe? Are they gone? You're okay now. Nobody's gonna hurt you. Those things were crawling all around the shed. They would have found us for sure. We owe you our lives. Uh, I still can't believe it. When we saw that ship, I thought it was all over. It showed up right before the attack. I knew it was trouble the second I saw it. So we made a break for the sheds. Okay, now this is what I was talking about. I'm going to skip through unimportant Tell me stuff that I'm investigating. Us, you don't know that. It's just, we survived. Do you know anything we're about just farmers. It's just information. It just, just gives you codex stuff. That's them really them not some important. Kind of signal as it it was probably trying Whatever to it was. If you really want to read it, and just pause the video whenever I get to those screens and read it. But jeez, Blake, you gotta learn when to shut up. You have I don't like wasting that much time. <laughs> Some guys at the spaceport were running a small smuggling ring. Nothing major. In exchange for a cut of the profits, we let them store packages. In if our I were to show all the investigation uh, conversations in this game, it would be like a five million part let's play. So I'm not doing that. Breaking the law, cool. <laughs> we're not hurting anybody. Well, most of the time, I don't even know what's in the packages. Just thought there might be something we could use. I found a pistol. Figured it would come in handy if those things came back. But you'll probably get more use out of it than we will. And this is why you put in charm or intimidate points. You get extra stuff. We're risking our lives to save this colony. You sure there's nothing else in here that could help us out? Yeah, there's one more thing. I was gonna sell it after this was over, but you probably deserve it more than I do. Who's your contact at the spaceport, Cole? What's his name? He's not a bad guy. I don't want to get him in trouble. Besides, I'm not a snitch. He might have something to do with this whole attack, Cole. We need his name. It's important. Yeah, okay, you're right. 
His name's Powell. Works the docks at the spaceport if he's still alive. I have to go. Good luck. And let's find out. Oh god, that. Okay. Find out what they're doing in here. What they're hiding. No. Can I level up? I think so. See if I can put in some electronics. Oh uh, no, I can't. Actually. Ha! -ha. I don't know if that counts though. So let's see. Damn it! <laughs> All right. Oh my goodness. So cluttered. The damn gas leaving a damn mess. Commander, it's not I know it's Nihilus, but hold on, Nihilus. You're gonna have to wait, because there's some stuff over here. Loot! Ah, ah, ah. A Turian? You know him? <laughs> Excuse me. <sighs> He's a special. <laughs> he was with us on the norm. Ugh. Something's moving over behind those crates. Wait! Don't don't shoot! I'm one of you! I'm human! Sneaking up on us like that nearly got you killed. Do it, Shepard. Do I'm it. I'm sorry, I was hiding from those creatures. My name's Powell. I saw what happened to that Turian. The other one shot him. I need to know how Nihilus died. The other one got here first. He was waiting when your friend showed up. He, he called him Saren. I, I think they knew each other. Your friend seemed to relax. He let his guard down. And Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. I, I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. We were told a Prothean beacon was brought to the spaceport. What happened to it? It's over on the other platform, probably where that guy Saren was headed. He hopped on the cargo train right after he killed your friend. I knew that beacon was trouble. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I hadn't been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. And Cole mentioned you. Cole's contact here on the docks for the smuggling ring. What? No! I mean... What does it matter now? So I'm a smuggler, who cares? My supervisor's dead, the entire crew's dead. It doesn't matter now, does it? Anything hidden nearby that we could use against the Geth? A shipment of grenades came through last week. Nobody notices if a few small pieces go missing from the military orders. You greedy son of a bitch. We're out here trying to protect your sorry ass, and all you can think about <laughs> is how you can rip us off? I Go Ashley. Need those grenades. She's awesome. Attack Eden Prime. We're just a bunch of farmers. How was I supposed to know? Forget about him. He's not worth it. You're lucky the commander now. <laughs> Hand over those grenades. Oh, yours. I love her. Take them. My smuggling days are over. I swear. A lot of Marines died here. I read. Those grenades could have come in handy. If I were you, I'd think of some way to make it up to them. Yeah, uh, okay. There is something else I was saving. Could be worth a fortune. Experimental technology, top of the line. Take it. I don't need it. I didn't want anyone to get hurt. Really, I'm sorry. And blah, Tell me blah, about blah. the gap. They must have been inside that mothership. How come you... Wait a minute. I... You survived. If you hadn't snuck yeah. out of that. Hard to believe that was only... A... And it was making this... All right. Take... Shut up. I, I, I can't stay here. Let's go. I need to get away from all this. Oh, God. That auto save lag though. <laughs> Boom. Killing it. Oh, look at that. Fucking 720 water stall YY no scope. Alright, actually, you know what? Before we advance down that bridge, this looks like a good spot to call it an episode. I'm at about 20 minutes. So, yeah, thank you for watching, and find out what goes on on the rest of Eden Prime next time on Let's Play Mass Effect. Thanks for watching.